Hey guys, welcome back. This is Mr. Hardcore Mode, where nothing's easy. Welcome back to more Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. I didn't want to move that much, because uh, there are some things that I want to touch. I just want to touch it just a little bit. I already look great. I don't need to grab all this. That... Right. What? Just not something I'd ever wear. But what don't we do for our... Hmm. Who exactly is she to me? Oh. Ooh, that kind of touched the spot. What he just said. Um, okay. Did I pick it up? Let me see this one. It's a blue one? Is it bleeding over? Yeah, that's weird. Ah, oh, it's doing it for that one, too. But the blue one... I hate it. Uh, just... Drop it. There we go. I hope they finally get storage in this place, because I'm tired of this. Alright, I'm going to grab a few things from here, see if I can get some dialogue. Oh, I need that. It's, I got that book already. Moving on. What's in here? What's in here? Broken rake. Why does everybody have a broken rake out there, please? Now this, I wanted to see. Glamour. Scent of lilac and gooseberries. Even with the lid on, taste hasn't changed. Hmm. No idea how she managed to bring so much clothing. Must have hired out a galleon. As usual, black and white. Uh-oh. Hmm. The stuffed unicorn. She fixed it. Uh, she fixed it up and I'm just like, yo, I'm not that type of person to like be like, yo, hit that and quit it. Like, yo, Triss is awesome. What she has done through Witcher 1 through 3, it's all great. And that's what... What the hell? I thought he was going to fight me for a second. <laughs> but... Hmm. Go on there. Mm, up here. Are you drunk? Yeah, you drunk. Maybe I could get a new hairstyle in here. There he is. Greetings. Smooth seas this morn, as if the gods themselves were paying their respects to the great Konung Bran. You a tailor? I am. Only one in the Isles, most like. Gladly look at what you got. Wise man. No common rags among my wares. Oh, he's got... No, 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 no. This is not what I want. Take it, you're good with scissors. Give me a haircut. It ain't something I usually do, but it wouldn't be right to turn down a traveler. He don't got no chin. Mm. Elven rebel cut? No, we already did that. What about long and loose? Let's check it out. We gotta look good for the festivities. Hmm. Not bad. Kinda like it. And I kinda want my beard back. Didn't I do this last time? Oh, that was way, way back though. Hmm. So long. I'll take it like this. Excellent. He looks like a god. Loyal. Y'all better get out of my way. I like Skellica. I like it already. This place is beautiful. All this rain and 
hell oh that's pretty oh and if there are more missions to do I'll get it later I don't wanna I wanna focus on the main mission How far is this? Might as well go on a steed. Get to the party. On a steed. Come on, Roach. I guess I'm going ah uh, the upper area that we just saw. I guess we're heading there right now. Skellica is it's beautiful. To say the least. Ah, oh, they did this game right. Watch yourself, buddy. Yeah, I might want to watch myself. I don't want to fall off. That's permanent death. I mean, Geralt has fallen off of like a one-story building and died. I've seen it. I seen it. Is that the same term as Karamorn? Karatol? Ah. They're probably gonna Brand tell me to get rid of my. He needs a worthy successor. You speak as though you have someone in mind. Already? trouble is very much derived from it not being a hereditary monarchy. Any upstart can be king and destroy his predecessor's legacy. The king of the Isles is a more symbolic position. That should change as well. A strong leader who wields true power. That is what the times require. Well, I see you. Introduce me. This is my friend Geralt, and this is Berna, widow of the dear departed Bran. The Queen Mother. It's a pleasure to meet you, Geralt. You must forgive me. But on a day like today, I'm afraid I cannot indulge in my penchant for long conversations. I can tell the accent has changed since I I'm in Skilliga. You chose your own outfit. You know, of course, that together we look about as good as lace frills on a battle axe. Everyone's got their style. I'm wearing it. <sighs> Don't like funerals. Don't like feasts. I know. You also dislike underdone meat and being teleported. But sometimes we must overcome our disgusts and prevail. We should mingle before they all get drunk. There'll be no talking to anyone then. Good thinking. I don't know what Krach wants. When we meet with him, we should have clear minds. I'm not gonna drink. Why dull my senses when I'm in such pleasant company? Do you plan to compliment me all evening? I plan to tell you what I think. Oh, we're gonna we're messing things up. <laughs> it's all good. So, what have you brought for the farewell? Yeah, the whole bread, sheep's milk cheese. Our wagon's full of loot. We ripped from the black ones. Yen is looking good. Wind's how it's been howling. There's something I've been meaning to ask you. Uh oh. Your beard. Why did you decide to grow it out? Don't really know. Hmm. Must say it suits you. I'm not even, I don't even have my beard right now, but I appreciate it. How did, what's going on right now? She doesn't know that I'm, like, freaking custom fitted, and now she thinks I have a beard. Sorry. My companion is Geralt of Rivia. I am honored. Nice to meet you too. Quite a few guests. They come to bid their king farewell. They come to see the claimants to the crown. We wanted to talk to Croc on Crate. The Jarl will join us shortly. He's assigned you a place of honor at the table just beside his daughter, Ceres. Follow me, please. That is if she shows up. They've seated us here. I asked them to. Wanted to meet the notorious witcher, Geralt. Saskia! Don't remember. That was ages ago. Yalmer and I were children when you last visited Orda. 
But you should meet your feast mates and learn me the dubious honor. That's Halbjorn, son of Holger Blackhand, Blue Boy Lucas, Madman Lucas's firstborn, and choking down a stockfish over there is Otric on Hindar. I'm not gonna remember all these fascinating, awesome names. Seems they set us with the sons of Jarls exclusively. Ceres on Crate is the daughter of a Jarl, Geralt. Jarl's daughters are in no way inferior to their sons. Do you know every last one of them dreams of being Bran's successor? Look at him. Likely lot. Ceres is jealous, for the one among us who performs the greatest feat will be crowned king. <laughs> we all know the feats are a sideshow. Our fathers will choose who will wear the crown. What do you think they spoke to Crack about? You talk like that because you're short of strength and skill. Remember when Hjalmar challenged us all to a race up the mount? You didn't stand with us then. As he buried his axe in that stump at the top to mark his victory, you were warming your chicken bones by the fire. Had my reasons for not participating, but I would have won then, as I'd win now. <laughs> He's like, yeah, now yeah, yeah bullshit. Him, just noticed Hjalmar's not here. My brother walks his own paths. But about the race... I thought it was Saskia. It? I'm wrong. I'm willing to challenge any of you, Witcher included. If I'd beat him to the top, venture to say that'd be a feat, eh? So you in? If the Witcher's in. Geralt? Fucking A, yeah, you better give me a new frickin' saddle. Gladly. What are the rules? Whoever pulls Hjalmar's axe from the stump at the top of the hill wins. Stray off the path and you lose. And here I was, ready to puke from all the boredom. Let's go! Woo! Yeah, I thought it was Saskia, but I was wrong. It was, um... We're here. From this spot, we must reach the top of that mount. At the summit, you'll see the stump of an oak. Yalma's axe buried in it. Whoever pulls the axe from the stump first, wins. I'm ready. She looks badass. We'll start when I sound the horn. Uh, that's like the third woman today that I've been thinking about. I'm not cheating. She's... I'm already past you. What are you? Get out of the way, goats! Get out of the way! Wait, delve from the path? I don't want to delve from the path. They might say something. I was just thinking about getting up there, but I was just like, never mind. I just realized my shoes are huge. I look like a freaking gnome. Or better yet, a smurf. Oh, oh. No, 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 girl. We're not Show doing that today. Oh, oh, you gotta be careful around here. Oh, you gotta be careful around here. Jeez, girl, you're getting old. Blah. Made it. I won, but only by a hair. No such thing. There's winning and there's losing, and I lost. Well, at least you know that. Let's go back to the week. Let's. Over here thinking about three women. Three women. Jeez. See the wakes in full swing. Lost sight of you. Who won? You weren't there. I lost. Lost to a Witcher Sparrowhawk. That would likely happen to any of us. Enough of the nather and let's drink. Mm. 
Can't today, for good reason, believe me. But if not today, then when? You've been great company. Sadly, it's time we moved on. Really? Indeed. We must talk, but not here. You don't. shall learn all beyond that door. I was like, I was like, Yennefer, don't. She's, she has such a freaking seductive look. Shame. Why would I? The queen should join her king on her tradition. Feast the character. I don't want to fall for it. I can't fall for it. This is a freaking party. It's a kind of party I lack. Allow me to introduce Geralt of Rivia, a witcher. Geralt. Jarl Dona and Hinder, and Jarl Madman Lugos. Calling Lugos a madman's an insult to madmen. He's a common goat fucker. Call me a goat fucker one more time, and I'll chop off your head, stick it on a pike, and piss down your neck hole. Ah, oh, hey, no. charming. Time to settle this. Here and now. Oh. Do it. <laughs> Giving me a true freight right now. Shat my best trousers. Put that away before you cut yourself, you cunt. Settle this outside. Who the fuck are you to advise me, eh? Someone with better manners. You insult Bran's memory and Crack's hospitality with this. Emperor would be very pleased to hear you quarrel. His Imperial Majesty is more than welcome to visit. Let him sail over here. We ain't afraid of the Black Ones. Raiding coastal villages is one thing. Total war with the Empire is another. Awfully melty, this one. Go stir your cauldron and pierce some boils, witch. Don't talk when you Damn. have a fucking clue. Oh. 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 Know what, Lugos? Just realized I don't give a damn about your hallowed rules of hospitality. Finally, some toy version. And here I was ready to puke from all the boredom. No, you've Come gone on, too far. Freak. You've gone Show too far. What you're made of. Jennifer might not be. There's to be some dope slapping. She not might not be my girl in this playthrough. You don't buck with my friends. Let's do it. Piece of. Ooh, you know I'm champion in Novograd, right? What? I'm champion in Novigrad, oh shit. You'll never learn. Hmm. Come on, come on. Come on, bring it. Bring it. I'll come to you, I'll come to you. Boom. Come on. Come on. I'm champion in Novograd and in Velen. Bring it. Boom! Welcome to my world. Don't fuck with you yet. Had enough? Ah, ah, you got me good. That were quite a while up. Still seeing spots, room, rocking like a leaky tub in a hurricane. We'll call it even then, as soon as you apologize to the lady. Don't hold it against me, my lady. It's my deep conviction sorceresses are needed. Deep be so. No offense taken. Forget about it. That I like. And the knocking. It's what men do. Give me your paw, Witcher. Let me squeeze. It's a worthy one. Witcher, have a I like drink with me. Proof there's no hard feelings. And visit me at times, I insist. Yaren's been jabbering about bringing in a witcher for that haunted lighthouse. Do me a favor, meet him for an ale in the tavern near Aaron Bjorn. Then you put a short jaunt to find me, so as we can knock back something stronger. Here's to our next. Uh, this place is so awesome, but I can't drink right now. They want me to Drunk for crying out loud over here. Mmm. 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 
can't. No hard feelings, but we'll have to drink another time. Yes. We've important discussions ahead. You land rats are all the same. Fear to your wenches. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just afraid that girl might not speak correctly when in coming of conversations. What now? Now we pay a visit to Ermion's laboratory. Didn't know we'd been invited. Because we've not been. Take it Ermion won't be there. That's right. And what's the purpose of this visit? We're looking for an object. The Mask of Erberos. We'll need it. Come, Geralt. Come in. Oh, I'll God. tell me why you need this mask. Oh, I shall. In due course. Take it, you'll decide when. Correct. See, this is... This is why I cannot... She is so mysterious. At the same time, it's hot, but at the same time, it's fucking frustrating. Just trust me, woman. Just... Trust me. Damn. Okay, I'm done. I'm done ranting. Let's go. Am I overcumbered already? <sighs> I got so much stuff. I got so much, so many things. Did I put gloves on? No, I don't need no gloves on. Hmm. I'm pretty sure. What's weighing me down is all this dwarven spirit that I'm holding on. I don't think I need that much. Oh. I'll leave that alone. Quest items, yada yada. I'm so glad I got my money back. I'm still thinking about it. Are these others? Oh, it's needed to complete a quest. I won't throw those away. Mm. Oh, I hope they change the inventory. I'll make each of all of those. Uh, don't need any of those. Can't do those. Never made a superior insectoid. I thought I was a good alchemist. Turns out I was wrong. Do I need this shirt anymore? No, drop it. I'm good. And if I need any more shirts to, you know, like crafting, I know where to get more. Okay, I get it. There's beer everywhere. Yan, yan, yan. You need to know the truth. Wait, did I technically cheat on her? Were they together? Ah, uh, she's gonna hate me. Footsteps. Oh. Oh, those freaking shoes they're bad hide behind the tapestry sparrows chip white star leaves trip what do jackdaws do jackdaws call goldfinches warble and cranes whoop whereas peacocks screech no 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 uh, oh god Tom's, they coo that's all of them got it <laughs> What about nightingales? No, 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 no. All ah, right, nightingales croon. 
different sounds of animals, really. Yeah, it's probably chafing. I'd rather wear my freaking Griffin school armor. <laughs> that was close. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. I'm getting blinded by the sexuality in here. But I'm not that type of guy. This will be tough to open. Surprises never end. See the ravens? Hard not to. Fermion spies. An indication that we're near his laboratory. I also sense a clear magic aura. Come, there's a ledge outside this window. We must pass along it. Oh, I did see that. Hmm. We will use it. Open it. You want me to open it? Okay. Oh, oh okay. Alright. Seen uglier sights in my life. Geralt of Rivia being romantic. Hmm. Ooh, this is going to be fun. Oh. Sorry, I had to pick up the phone, but uh we're back. Alright. Oh, yeah. Looking good. Looking good there. Mm-hmm. Get some lemon. Oh, we don't need to open that door. Amazing how a hobby can render a man mysterious. Especially a druid. Must be a real nature lover. Huh. Oh, ignite! Ignite! Yeah! Had one at Care More. <laughs> Please. What is that supposed to mean? Please. What about these wolves? Looks alive. That's all right. Let me let me touch the deer. Let me touch the deer. Uh, why is it always a problem? A hundred loose and arrow if you saw that in the woods. A reflection of Ermion appears on the surface. Supplicants speak to it. Hmm. Okay, Ermion. What else do you have? What about down here? Ah. Are you all right? Cut myself. The door is locked. The animals, they're alive. Yen, watch out. Oh. Right. Monsters. Whoa! Feelings coming closer. They're everywhere. Uh. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. These aren't actual monsters, are they? Oh, come on. Am I actually injuring them? Oh, I guess I got no choice. That's one less. That's one less. What is going on in here? Mushrooms. Yeah, 
You definitely got drugged. alive why not they can be aggressive too ouch anymore bring it bring it homie And he... Oh, okay, he just comes on closer. Oh, that's that. What? What? Oh. Still... Drugged. Who was I fighting? What's happening? You were hallucinating. You ran at Ermion's animals. Sword flailing, I had to calm you. <laughs> Mind if we uh, never mention this again? <laughs> Naturally. <laughs> Doors open. We'll proceed as soon as you've collected trophies of your kings. <laughs> Let's go inside, Geralt. Let's talk about at least one of them. Oh, come on. It's, yeah. Looks alive. Oh, what, what, really? Not any, okay, whatever. I'll lock the entrance. We don't want to raise suspicions. Ah, our dear druid's laboratory. We must search it thoroughly. The mask of Erberos must be here. Hmm. Ermion's correspondence. Wondrous world the druids insectoids. Warns them about you. Ritual plants. Ah, what do you know? Raymond Marlove. A biography enhanced. Hmm. Well, let me read this. Oh, wrong way. Brother Druids, be forewarned that a sorceress has arrived on Erd uh, Skellig. Her name is Yennefer, and she hails from Vengerberg. Vengerberg, I know you are an immune to feminine wiles and will not let a well-draped skirt muddle your reasoning. Nevertheless, I, want, I warn you not to be taken in by her intelligence and refinement. I know who Yennefer is. I do not. I do not, however, know the true goal of her stay in Skellige. Neither do I. Hmm. Yennefer has displayed an unhealthy interest in the sight of the cataclysm we are striving to study. I have not given her permission to go near it, but I caution you to keep your eyes and ears open to all the same sorcerers from Vennerberg is a stubborn and uh, effective manipulator. I know that it is a past that it in the past her and cracks past crossed. I suspect that she will wish to use this old friendship for some ulterior purpose. What that is exactly, I will not try to determine. Once I do, I will inform you in a separate letter. Uh, yeah, yeah. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Seems Ermion has real tobacco brought in. Hmm. Skelliger's tales about the wild hunt. The islanders believe the wraith sail on a longship built of the claws of dead men. That sounds awesome. Pinecone. Didn't expect this. A large female.
What would a pine coat? Uh, you know more than I do, Witcher. I'll let you be the expert. Damien's wand. He's one of the few druids to use one. Can I take this? A sword and a stone. Things begging me to pull it out. It's not in the stone, don't you see? It's held there by a vice. It's not in the stone. Hmm. One day. Laboratory worthy of an Imperial alchemist. What a is this? carved out of Lindenwood, signed to Uncle Ermion. Little Ciri's handiwork. That's what she called him when he was her tutor. Oh man, back in the past. White Frost? Do I have that book? I don't think I do. I don't think I have that book. <laughs> Looks like Ermion places something in the statue's hand. What do you say we give it a pine cone? Mm, nothing. Mm. Need something else. Gotta look around. Nice thought, though. Definitely. Look at this. A detailed map of the Northern Kingdoms even shows spheres of influence over the ages. Out of date. Oh, yeah. Definitely out of date. There's all that blue, uh... And that's Temerit? Yeah. That was before the war. A child's skull. Well, if it's a child's skull, this might be a little fucked up. But it sounds very skellige. Dwarven triple mead. I want to say. Let's try again. So, statue. How about a skull? Nothing. Hmm. Guess you're no indecisive prince. Let's try the mead. How about a mug of mead. That's Get true. Sure or not, everybody needs a drink sometimes. I <laughs> heard something. Seems like it worked. Who would have thunk? Ermion enjoys jests achieved at the expense of others. I have a sneaking suspicion the mask will be in here. Uh. Looks like we got company. Hold on a second. We need to change. Since I'm not wearing, you know, proper attire. I'll let it go once I die. <laughs> uh, I'm done. No, not wrong boots. And the hands. And why not fire? I got enough. And it sounds like an elemental. If it's down here and it's in these caves, it's an elemental. Don't think I don't know. Let's go. See? There he is. This is it. That's the mask you were looking for, isn't it? We've got it. We must return to the feast quickly before. <laughs> God, it's disgusting looking. It's a trap. We're in oh, we know that. Oh, clipped me. 
I'll be the tank, you be the wizard. People keep on calling me, but we're back. I can slow him down. Uh, Damn druid will poison us. This vapor's deadly. We've got but a few minutes. Teleport us out of here. Think of something. Quickly. First thing to come to your mind. Uh... Hold on tight. <laughs> it was like, uh, is like kiss her right now? It's like, uh, don't do that. <laughs> Yes, guys, I want to kiss her, but not now. Hey, y'all enjoying the party? They don't give a fuck. No, heed my word. There is no greater act of valor than to fight a beast cursed by men and gods. No greater deed than that done to serve the goddess. Words of uncommon beauty. We thank you. We will take them to heart. But now, let's begin. We have seen Bran off to the beyond and must now choose his successor. A king must be wise, a king must command respect, a king must have bollocks! We've no lack of men like that. Let those who feel worthy of the throne of Skellige step forth! She's gonna do it, isn't she? Be here this day. Behold his axe. Behold his will. Wow, she's got some bollocks. May the best man. A woman win. What do you know?
What's got into her? She's your daughter, is she not? Now I know why she said she'll sail to speak her of. Ah, children. The older they grow, the more trouble they are. Come with me. <laughs> Girls like yes. I know what that means. How was it, Geralt, when Ciri was nearing womanhood? I remember well her nan, her mother, what they were like. They say the apple doesn't fall far from the tree. Ciri was impossible to control. No telling her what to do. Had to have things her own way almost always. Why do you ask? No specific reason. She and Ceres, they're of a similar age. But we'll speak of my children later. First, let's speak of yours. Yennefer claims Ciri's in trouble. And you seek her. That's right. If you require aid, gold, ships, anything, merely say the word, I'll give you all I can. And I know the last lives. I'm sure of it. When the blood of Rhiannon's daughters is shed, the sea grows white with fury. I'd mark such a storm. Hmm. Uh. Need your help. Siri probably came here to Skellige. And very likely caused the cataclysm along the coast. The site upon which the druids focus so intensely now. A site Ermion refuses to let us explore. Specifically, he won't let me explore it. We fought. We're not friendly now. Don't concern yourself with him. Druids have little trust for mages. But Ermion's heart is in the right place. Am I right to assume he does not know you seek Siri? It's of no concern to him. As I thought. At any rate, <laughs> art Skellig's my isle. You have my permission to investigate as you see fit. Mm, wait, what? Thank you. No need. I swore an oath once, I'm not going to say the I second part. Get somebody pissed. Anvil, tell the druid I must speak to him at the usual spot. I have one more matter to broach. My children. You remember Yalmak? Well, he swore an oath to kill the giant of Unthik. Set off and has yet to return. But as Ceres announced, that she's to set off on an adventure of her own. Got it in her head that Udelric is not mad, but cursed. Hmm. Ceres intends to lift Urok's curse. Take it, Ceres wants to lift the curse. There's no curse to speak of. Ceres has decided she must match Yalma and sought out a deed worthy of a queen. Think she might need my help? You did plan to ask me for it. Why? The thing is, I don't trust Ulrich further than I can spit. <laughs> Ceres won't listen to me. Or her brother. Yet confronted by a professional who will explain why she's mistaken, she just might come to her senses. So, yes, I ask that you explain things to her. And bring her back. No desire to be king yourself? Can't help wondering. Got no plans to vie for the crown yourself? Think a good number of the Jarls would support you. A good number? Those opposed would be fierce, rabid. Madman Lugas would sooner see an elf guardian on the throne. Besides, a man should know when to step aside. Hand the tiller to the youth among us. Giants. They've been extinct for ages. Anyone actually seen the one on Undvik? Aye, dozens of refugees have. The giant drove everyone off the isle. I've welcomed what remains of Clan Tordalach here on Artskelly. I heard a rumor. 
that an unnatural frost gripped Undvik before the giant appeared. It's true. At any uh. rate, Yalmar decided to kill the giant and give the isle back to its people. A deed worthy of a king, he believed. It sounds I like it. gathered a hearty crew at the new port. They were to sail to Unvik, then travel on foot to Oska, the village. But that many lads should have killed the giant long ago. Thus, I thought to ask you. You should start at the new port. Ask around. Hjalmar might have told someone there his plans. If either Hjalmar or Ceres need help, I'll help them. I thank you. No now problem. Done thanking one another, let's get to work. We must determine if Siri is still on Ardskellig. I'll change into travel attire and find you. Head south. The anomaly we should investigate destroyed a stretch of forest along the shore of the bay. A successful feast on all counts, Krav. I will see you later. She is a fierce woman, and I do like that. Got me some experience points. This place is humongous. Guys, guys, look at this place. It's a lot to go on. A lot more adventures to do. So, don't expect me to do the main mission right after this, because it ain't gonna happen. I'm gonna do some side missions. Anyway, I'll see y'all later. Take care.